Hi everyone, I'm Ricky from Tech Talk and today we're unboxing and getting our first look at the Google Home Mini. So let's get into the unboxing and setup process. So the Google Home Mini is small and mighty, that's their tagline, and say hello to the Google Home Mini that can be paired with your Google Home, or you can use this on its own. So at the moment, around the Christmas period, it's been selling for about $34.99. Most places are still selling at this price. When it first came out, it was $49.99, which is quite expensive. It's a hands-free help around the home powered by Google Assistant. So look around the packaging first. I have chosen the charcoal color here. There are two other colors, you've got a chalk color which is a kind of white a whitish creamy sort of color and then you have coral which is quite a bright red which I think looks very vibrant and very nice so on the side here you can see third-party applications such as Netflix Spotify then you have the hue lighting system and other smart home applications that work alongside the Google Home mini and also smart home products there is a website down here as well that you can go and check out for further information if you do have any questions or queries about third-party applications or smart home tech drop a comment down below and I'll sure to help you out so turning around to the side here we've got some more information that I'm gonna so Google Home Mini is powered by the Google Assistant ask it questions tell it to do things it's never been easier to get hands-free help in any room you get questions answered use the power of Google to get real-time answers for your questions tackle your day set alarms and reminders find out your commute and get the news and more enjoy your entertainment use your voice to play your music or start a tv show with the compatible music and video services voice control your home control compatible smart home devices like your like your lights thermostat and much more turning around you'll see the google assistant section here where you can ask google anything and we'll be testing out these here and some fun ones for the christmas period so let's get into the unboxing so i have my new sharp knife here this is razor sharp so down here on the bottom you just have a bit more information and then you also have a tab you just need to pull here we get a nice reveal of our google home mini here and this is the charcoal speaker underneath you have let's get started this is your paperwork information get to know your google home and be safe with warranty then finally down here at the bottom you've got your uk three pin plug which have changed compared to the previous google home which has a micro usb there so taking a closer look at our google home mini here it's a nice fabric design it's a nice shape as well down here at the bottom you'll see your port and then you have a switch here you've got a rubberized pedal or foot stand for it to sit on so it won't slip and also won't mark. I do like the design of this, very sleek, very stylish. So let's plug it in. You're gonna need a smartphone to set up the Google Home application, which is available from Android or iOS. Welcome to Google Home. To get started, download the Google Home app on a phone or tablet. Now our Google Home Mini has all been set up in the application here on iOS. It's very easy to do on Android as well. Just search the Google Play Store. You have loads of information in here as well, giving details that you can maybe ask Google. Look through link accounts as well. Remember there's loads of links for different accounts that you can connect and control and third party applications and smart home technology as well. Just wanna show you the speaker itself around at the top here. You do have a microphone button that you can turn on or off, so it doesn't act so it doesn't hear you all the time. The microphone is back on. In your booklet here that comes along in the packaging, you do have some control systems as well. So in the middle, you do have your main play pause, and also either side you have your volume up or your volume down. And you have your play pause in the middle there. Then you have Google Assistant and some more information. So we can talk to Google Assistant. Okay, Google, tell me about my day. Good afternoon. The time is 2.41 p.m. Currently in Prince's Risborough, it's two degrees and partly cloudy. Today it'll be partly cloudy, with a forecast high of one and a low of minus four. 
Have a nice day. Here's the latest news and headlines from BBC News at 2.21pm today. So you can talk to Google, you can ask it multiple different things, you can set reminders, you can set an alarm. OK Google, set an alarm for tomorrow morning at 8am. Right, your alarm set for tomorrow at 8am. You can also add reminders, notes and also calendar events in there as well. If you do have any questions or comments, please do let me know. Thanks always for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye for now.